Hey, Joel Lightcatcher here. I'm in Rochester, New York at Mod My Mods, who helped me. Uh, well, this is Josh, or you like to be called... Brony. Brony. And he helped me uh, set up my uh, modified Alpha Cool with the soft tubing. And uh, he was just showing me uh, like some of his uh, cool stuff they did here. So you sell individual components... You sell parts to do custom sleeving. You do custom sleeving. You do your Any own C work. your own CNC work on um, cases. You do case modifications. You get hired by uh, PC manufacturers to make show pieces for expos. For sure. If I left anything out, um, I think that pretty much covers it. We're just your go-to guys for water cooling parts or just custom pimp your PC. In that is a, is a good way to put it. In beautiful Rochester, New York, the vacation capital of the Northeast. I, I don't know about that, but it's not so bad here. <laughs> this is the Demus Tech BFD. You can figure out what that stands for, because it's a real big desk. <laughs> uh, it's our prototype new, uh, basically, computer case. You can go build up to two systems inside it. Um, this was the first run around. We brought it to convention, get people's feedback doing some more fine-tuning on it before we throw it in the office and start using it on a day-to-day. -day. And it looks really, really cool. Two PCs. And sorry about all the keyboards in the way. Water-cooled <laughs> cool radiators in the legs. Very nice. So over here, we got our own water-making station. We take in the uh, city water, which personally wouldn't even drink, have a great filtration system here, reverse osmosis, get it down to zero parts per million pure water. Then from there, we can go and mix in the glycol and the other additives to make it a very suitable coolant for PCs. If we come over here, you can see some of the colors that we're gonna be uh, trying to produce as well. Um, right now, we have companies uh, prototype or testing out the clear, blue, green, and red for us. See how it works out, and hopefully we'll see them on our website soon enough. What's this uh, over here? All these colors. Sleeving station. If you ever need a custom looking cable, we have them. You want a pink SATA cable? Perfect. You want a, a multicolored ATX uh, pin extension? Uh, we can make them. So Mod My Mods has a whole CNC setup. Why don't you tell us about this? So we actually put this together um, ourselves. Got, got all the materials, got a kit more or less. Um, picked out a spindle that we could actually water cool hooked up our own uh, water cooling setup underneath here with an absolutely unnecessarily large radiator. You want to check that out. It's oh, a little look, ridiculous down look, there. Look, a water cooled CNC machine. Only Mod My Mods would do that to a CNC machine. Yeah, why not? Yeah, we use it on a day-to-day -day basis, take uh, custom orders. We do a lot of these Fantech panels. Um, we go and cut out airflow holes, um, install filter material, uh, really go and get the temperatures down in a lot of these cases that have just terrible design. You're not getting a whole lot of airflow through that. But that, that'll work. We got a little custom setup right here. Why don't you tell us, what, what did you make here? So this is obviously the uh, motherboard setup that's going in our new custom build we're doing uh, to go and promote the new video game Wolfenstein Youngblood. Uh, we went and kind of played off the whole cyberpunk futuristic-y uh, nonsense with these nice hex patterns, uh, wrapping it in the gold. We're doing a lot of the case in a wrapped black, so this is going to be the front panel for it. Uh, we also did some etching, laser etching on the tempered glass side panel that's over here. Kind of hard to see, but once we get some lights behind there, it'll you look wonderful. You can see the Eiffel Towers there etched in the glass. And then uh, we have the rest of the case in pieces right now in that box right there, ready to go back together as soon as uh, we have the final final ingredient, which are our LED matrices. So if someone wanted to see this, where would it be on display? This is going to be down... Oh, I can't remember now. Yeah, we'll post it in the description if we can remember. Exactly. We'll figure it out for you. Don't worry. So tell us what we got here, Brody. Brody? Brony. 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 <laughs> hey, Brony, tell, us, tell me what we got here. So in, on top of all the custom uh, vinyl wrapping and paint that we did on that uh, motherboard the, and the case, we're going to be including some crazy 
LED matrix uh, lighting setups. So this guy right here is going to go on the back side of the graphics card. So when you look into the case, that'll be sitting upright for you. There you go. Uh, we're going to have this next to it. And uh, we're also going to have a full power supply shroud with the same lighting scheme across the entire uh, power supply shroud front and top. Be able to go and pretty much do whatever we want to light this up. We can play videos on it. We can make gifts on it. Uh, set you, up crazy you can play. Like vi this. You can play videos on these. Panels? You can go and put together a video, and it will it'll take as much as it can. It'll dumb it down, obviously, because there's only so many LEDs to work with. Uh, but yeah, you can play a full video across one of these. That is. Ge a geek like me would love to throw this somewhere. I have no Audio. idea where I'd put it, but it's very cool. Yeah, show us. Let me, yeah, let me go add some some text here. How much do these things cost? Roughly. Hundreds. Hundreds? Yes. Well, they were ridiculous. Well, <laughs> now, now that you've said that, I I realize uh, I just have to have lust in my heart for one. Go and change the the opacity of one effect over the other. So that comes out a little bit more and then I can do that I can add up to what is it eight layers of effects and have them all customized uh, where one can be more prominent I can have effects where it fades from one thing to another we could set up an hour's worth of a light show this and is, have it just play on on loop this almost looks like it's built for someone with much too much time on their hands that's kind of where my next couple weekends are probably going to end up. <laughs> Me sitting in front of this playing with lights. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for sharing that. So over here we got our shipping station for Mob My Mods. Anytime your orders come through, I'm sitting here waiting for them, waiting to print them out, get them run in our big warehouse of product here, pack them up, and ship them out. And that's a lot of warehouse space here. Oh yeah, boxes and, on boxes. And you got, you got even more... Behind those doors. Behind those doors is our newest addition to the Mod My Mods uh, house. <laughs> so yes. <laughs> Come on, show going? us like you're really working. <laughs> this is the infamous president and owner of Mod My Mods, who is camera shy. So this is his good side. Say hi. <laughs> hi. Oh, it's too late. You ruined it. <laughs> the lady's like, this seems light. I go, 